here today, gone tomorrow, but willing to stay forever. Knowing that's impossible, but also knowing how to maximize our chances. I was struggling with inspiration back in the days, but I also learned something special along the way. Just being there in that momentum of life or truly living it, that's what we're facing out there every second. You can be the one who observes or you can be the one who explores, leave first footprints and move the boundaries. A few years ago, I was the one who observes. I was scared of unknown. I would rather stay comfy at home than risk that one step that takes you straight to a whole new adventure. It's funny looking back and actually seeing how many opportunities pass by with every second not being present. You can't rewind moments and stop time. When something is gone, it's gone forever. You can't get it back. It's true, and it hurts. Let me tell you something. If you're used to go left, now it's time to turn right. And if you're used to go down, now it's time to go up. Stepping out of ordinary to witness extraordinary. Unleashing our full potential to experience amazing places and visuals of our planet. Don't be afraid. You may feel increased heartbeat and strange heat going all over your body and some nerves, but that's totally fine. That only means that you are in the right way. Listen carefully. I remember when I made that first decision to step from observing mode to actually going and experiencing. You'll see inspiration is all over the place in whichever direction you turn. Everything is on the right place and all with right purpose. It's just up to you to find and see it. It's, it's like a big giant puzzle of life. The more pieces you find and put together, the more of that huge endless picture of life you see. Someone once said, among the clouds in the big blue sky, where you merge into one with nature, that's, that's where all the true answers lie. Following these steps, I found my way for now. And now, it's up to you. In which direction will you turn next?